All right, welcome back. Don't have a table, so I gotta sit in the house. Take about this beer in a minute. All right, so it's the Rogue Bat Squatch Hazy IPA. Uh, I got this from Walmart. I know a uh, six pack, I think, was like $12 or something around there. There's your color, kind of dark. Um, let me look see. There's a can on date on this bitch. Can eight one twenty. Uh, we're sitting at the end of October at the moment, and I've had this for probably nearing three weeks. So honestly, when I bought it, it was a little over a month old. Uh, well within the the good measures, and still being not even two months old, it still should be within the good measures of being a citrusy tropical IPA. Uh, it smells kind of bready, like a Hawaiian sweet roll with a little bit of orange oil on it. Fuck me. That's weird. This was the last one I had left. And all the others before this one were a little different as well. Um, this is the good one. Uh, I think I've, the first one I had was similar to this one. Um, and every other one tasted different. Uh, it tasted like a really old, malty, shitty IPA. This is, it's not top-notch trop tropical and citrus like they're, they're saying on the little diagram there. It is drinkable. I mean, if they were all this good, it'd be worth 12 bucks. But being as every can was different, I don't know, maybe their canning process sucked and maybe... You know, a couple of the, the cans got air in them, and I don't know, just fucked it up totally. Let me shit, I'll drink it. It's not as bad as what the uh, the past few cans. Like literally, I fucking drain poured two of these. Yeah, really, it's not too fucking bad. Um, I could have got everything rhymed with orange for 50 cents more, and I would rather got that. Uh, I know I'm comparing a, a local craft beer to Rogue, but if you get this, I mean, with me it was hit and miss, so with you, I hope, you, uh, hope you're prepared to understand that. Yeah, not too, not too bad. Um, the bready multi notes are not as strong in this one as uh, the other ones I had. Uh, it's slight orange-ish in a way. Yeah, like I said, it's almost like a similar to a Hawaiian sweet roll with a little bit of orange oil on it. Um, not excessively sweet. It is sweet though. Uh, overall, I like it. Uh, it's kind of fucking weird to say. So, Johnny, if you're watching this, <laughs> all yours must have been uh, shit. Yeah, I was going to drain pour this, but fuck it, I'm going to sit down and go ahead and drink it. Um, it's just, it's not. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm just too used to quality craft beer that I've had locally. You know, we got a lot of, a lot of uh, local... Uh, breweries, hell, even Prairie. That's a, a damn near nationwide brewery you can get. And uh, I get some of their small bat shit up in uh, Oklahoma City. So, uh, what they're going for, I'm going to say, fuck me, an eight. <laughs> uh, seven and a half, damn near. It's just, I wish it was more, you know, orange, grapefruit, peach. Uh, pineapple mango forward but it's not it's uh, an orange oil sprinkled Hawaiian sweet roll 
So, all right, there you go. We'll be seeing you.